Hi, folks, Max from GalaxyNote3Root.com for this week's T-Mobile Canadian and SMN9005 Note 3 ROM that we check out Canadian S5 ROM. Uh, this one is ported off straight from a Canadian Galaxy S5. Uh, the Canadian S5 ROM brings you almost all of the S5 features on your Note 3, uh, including uh, ultra power saving mode, which I'll show you here, and also download booster there. Uh, also, even S5 camera, which I'll show you in a second here, um, I believe. Also, for S Pen, uh, make sure you do turn on the air command as it's turned off by default. All of your note features, the three features will work out of the box. Um, you just get all these bunch of more stuff. Uh, basically, turns your phone into an S5. Uh, we've seen this similar ROM with the AT&T and the Verizon Note 3 in the last few weeks. Now it is finally available for those of you with T-Mobile Canadian or SMN9005. Uh, let me go ahead and show you the power saving mode uh, that I was trying to save, show you. There we go. So if you turn this on, you'll be able to go 10.8 days on 87%. Probably one of the main reasons of installing S5 ROM. Although you probably don't need it on this phone because the battery lasts uh, such a long time. Uh, what else can I show you here? I've also installed a compulsion kernel. The kernel that comes with it, the battery life isn't so great. Um, the way to fix it is simply install a custom kernel like compulsion kernel, which also allows you to overclock. And I've got it overclocked to uh, 2.6 gigahertz. You can do this by installing this Trickster mod app and then go ahead and go to general um, scroll down here and set that to the maximum 2.649 gigahertz. Also hit that button that will apply it. And also if you want to set it on boot uh, when you reboot your phone, make sure you hit kernel settings there um, and that will overclock it when you reboot your phone. And I don't really recommend overclocking unless you're playing hardcore games, but some of you play games all day so definitely check it out. Uh, and also for ult uh, ultra power saving mode, you can go ahead and choose the apps you want to show on it. Um, you know, all, uh, all of these apps you can go ahead and choose to show in the uh, ultra power saving mode. So you can still your, use your favorite apps uh, while saving battery life. Next, let me go ahead and show you the S5 camera it comes with. Um, this is pretty neat since you can enjoy the S5 camera on your Note 3. Uh, I didn't think it was possible, but I guess, you know, they're pretty compatible. And you'll be able to get new features um, like Panorama Virtual uh, Tour and also the S5 uh, menus. Obviously, this is a straight off on the S5. So you get all these new features that you can use. Also, there is selective focus, but don't use it because it will lock up your camera. That's the only thing it doesn't, it doesn't work. Um, but as you can see, um, camera works fairly good. Um, so you should have no problem. I get some of this uh, contact service error, uh, but that doesn't actually affect your recording. Um, it's just sort of annoying. And uh, let me go ahead and show you some of the other stuff. Oh, yes, the front camera. Um, the front camera also works very well. And you can take a look at my setup real quick there. Uh, I'll be getting a new um, one of those uh, photography lamps soon. I should have a review on that also. Uh, but looking very good, you'll get all the features of S5. Um, so definitely check it out for this week's Rome Week. And of course, S5 uh, settings. Now, this is a ported ROM, so you'll get all the features, real features, um, you know, not just uh, some, some of the parts just moved over. So definitely check it out for this week's ROM of the week. It is based on the latest Android 4.4.2. Again, it is available for Canadian T-Mobile SMN 9005. Um, so definitely flash it for this week's ROM of the week and do let me know what you think. And make sure you install Compulsion Kernel. Um, use a T-Mobile Compulsion Kernel version for T-Mobile and Canadian. And also for SMN9005, there's a separate version. Anyway, thanks guys for watching this video. And don't forget to donate to the developer of this ROM. I'll have links on my site. Uh, and as always, um, don't forget to subscribe to my emails at galaxynote3root.com if you have a Note 3 also. And stay hoy on Android.